Hi guys, Dr. Wendy Dearborn here from the Laws of Attraction in Action. Um, from uh, the Laws of Attraction in Action, see how quickly I, I became distracted. But guys, uh, for those of you who don't know me, I am a choice expert and that in itself uh, came about as, you know, life, life. Education, education, life, it's all one and the same. But what I wanted to actually talk about today, guys, is simply this. The only thing that we can control in life is choice. The only way we can control ourselves is through choice. Our lives are literally, and I, I, I our lives are built one choice at a time. Literally, guys, one choice at a time. Once you make a choice, once you make a choice, you cannot unmake it. That's actually not a choice. That's something that you can't do. Once you make a choice, it's yours. Once you've made a choice, you've bought it. Once you've made a choice, whatever it is that you have chosen, you have become energetically entangled with it. It becomes a part of you. If you've ever said, if I should, if I would, if I could have, if I, you know, if you've ever said anything like that, understand you have reflected upon the choices that you have made or the choice that you have made. And you have realized that you should have done something different, but the name of the game is that you didn't. So where you go now is, where do I move forward from here? And sometimes I feel like I'm saying the same thing over and over again. And re in reality, I am. You see, your life is all about your choices, guys. If you do not like the life that you are living, change your choice. Change the choices that you are making for yourself. Change the conception, the mental or emotional or the physical conception that you have of self. But by and large, change how you think about yourself. Change the concept that you have of you. You know, I've said this and I say this virtually every week on the radio show or, or the podcast. You cannot put a baby, once born, back into the uterus. You cannot put a spent bullet back into a gun. You cannot send your word out and try to pull it back. Once it's out there, guys, it is gone. And it will not, and I repeat to you, it will not return to you void. It's really important that you understand this. As much as people really hate to hear this, where you find yourself in life at this moment is predicated on the choices that you have made. Now, I'm not saying it's good or bad. And I'm not condoning anything that has been perpetrated against you your person, your family, your loved one, your country, your, I'm, I'm not saying that. But what I am saying to you is that you need to own your life 100% because whatever is happening to you, it's happening to you 100%. Be Mahatma Gandhi. Be the change that you want to see. Be the change that you want to see. You want more love in your life. Then be the loving soul. Be the loving energy. Be the loving person that you want to see coming into your life. You want more wealth. You want more health. You want, you want whatever it is you want. You need to be it. But all of that starts with choice. All of that starts with choice. And choice changes your life in the blink of an eye. 
Yesterday, I said to a girlfriend, and actually to my husband, uh, uh, funny enough, I said to him, we were talking, and I said to him, blink. And he looked at me, and I said, blink. So, guys, I'm telling you, blink. Just like that. Blink. Blink. Yeah, that's right. Blink. You can blink slow. You can blink quick. You can blink however, but just blink. And when you blink, guys, hear me clearly, when you blink, that's how quick your life can change. That's how quick your life can change. You can go from rags to riches in the blink of an eye. From the transition of life to death is in the blink of an eye. Saying something to somebody that changes your relationship, changes the, the total foundation of your relationship, whether good or bad, is in a blink of an eye. Understand that you are making choices 24 hours a day, 365 days out of the year, whether you're awake or whether you're asleep. You are making choices. You're making choices. So for me, to you, know that the only thing that you can truly control in your life are the choices you choose to make for yourself. That's the only thing you can control in, in your life. You cannot control anybody's reaction to the choices that you make. Now, based on us playing our psychological games or understanding the buttons to push or knowing somebody well enough to know how you feel that they will react based on past experience, yes, you can do X, Y, Z. You can make a choice to do this. And yes, you may get that reaction. But the truth is, the truth is, one day you may do X and you might not get that reaction. And that's because ultimately you cannot control anything external to you. Again, at the risk of sounding redundant, your life is an inside job with an external manifestation, guys. Your life is an inside job with an external manifestation. You also need to understand that any choice you make, it makes you responsible for that choice. You own it. And you'll be accountable for it. It's like action and consequence. For everything you do, there is a consequence. And this, this, the, the universal law of consequence doesn't care whether it is a good or bad action. It's a consequence. You do good and loving things, the consequence is good and loving things will come back to you. You do knowing to yourself not so nice things, not, no, not, not so nice things will come back to you. You see, our external life is a mirror image of what's going on inside. Our external, this is why they say that, you know, the people that you meet mirror, mirror who you are. And there's truth to that. There's truth to that. They mirror who you are. So guys, Take the time to really start figuring out what it is that you want. Take that time. Because you see, the time that you invest in that will be time that you invest in the right choice for you. Once again, your life is all about choices. All about choices. It is built one choice at a time. You want something different in your life, then you're going to need to choose it. You want to live a different life, you need to choose a different conception that you have of yourself. You want something different? Now's the time. So I'm going to ask you the golden question to ask yourself, what is it that I am wanting for me? And if you say to yourself, you know, I can't be bothered to do this. This is the internal conversation that you have. I can't be bothered to do this, then guess what? What is manifested to you is the same thing that you can't be bothered to do. Life can't be bothered with you if you cannot be bothered with life. This is your life. This is your life. Make the choices 
that you want so that you can create the life that you want to live. And you need to know the life that you want to live so you can create it. So make the choices. Tomorrow on, on our show, we are going to be talking about divine intervention. And divine intervention is as such that uh, they, they, they are, for all intent and purposes, uh, miracles. But a miracle cannot happen without you. And that's bottom line. A lot of people don't realize that. A miracle cannot happen without your input. Nothing on the face of this earth that happens to you has happened for you without your input. So guys, um, yeah, that's tomorrow at 1 o'clock, uh, 1 p.m. Uh, Pacific Standard Time on Blog Talk Radio. Or you can catch it, uh, you know, on my website, The Laws of Attraction, iTunes. Uh, you'll be able to catch the show. And for me, this is one that I think you should listen to. Many people are looking for di divine intervention. You know, if you're like, oh, God, help me. Or I need help. Somebody, anybody, please, somebody, anybody. If you've ever had that kind of conversation with yourself. If you ever had that experience, then this might be the show for you. So in closing, what I would say to you is this, guys. Um, know what it is that you are choosing. And as I'm always saying, no choice is a choice too. So know what it is that you are choosing, choosing to... Um, Know what it is that you are choosing for your life. You know, if, it's, if you're doing stuff that you don't want to do, you need to stop. Because eventually, the universal laws and or the manifestation law will manifest in true form what you really want. And so if you're saying yes when you really mean no and no when you really mean yes... The universe is going to set it up so that you can, you can do so accordingly. You can say yes or no. And set it up where you will be speaking your authentic truth. The only thing that you have control of in this life is your ability to choose. Do not choose to give that gift away by not exercising your full conscious potential to choose for yourself to make the life that you want to live. I'm Dr. Wendy Dearborn. Again, you can find me at the Laws of Attraction in action.com and of course the, the Facebook group. I encourage you to join both. And again, join me tomorrow, 1 p.m. Pacific Standard Time on Blog Talk Radio, where we're talking about divine, inter divine intervention. Bob, hope you're doing well, darling. Until next time, peace.